Hey guys, Moshe the Electric Israeli is here and thank you for joining. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and help me change the world one electric car at a time. If you recall on the first quarter earning call of 2020, Elon Musk did mention uh, the establishment of a design center in China, a design studio that will design a car for the Chinese market which will be designed in China, built in China, sold in China, but later on be sold in the, in the rest of the world. I'm not sure if we get to the United States. Uh, from the rendering, and I'm going to talk about it uh, in a minute, the rendering looks like a, a compact car. The wheelbase, the rear wheelbase look a little bit strange, but I'll get to it in a minute. Well, it looks like, and I'm going to show you um, a couple stickers about in advertising it's in chinese and also in english uh that tesla just put out in china looking for a i'm going to read you the list a design manager creative manager senior con car designer cmf manager cmf um, mastering specialist design quality specialist a content manager copywriter videographer video editor and graphic designer well, this seems to me uh, uh, a path for uh, staffing the uh, studio, the design center in China, thus leading towards what will uh, be a car designed and manufactured and sold at the beginning in China. Now, all Tesla cars are designed in Hawthorne, California. The, all the cars that they have so far, the, the, that's where they're designed, they're produced in one place, which is the uh, Freeman factory in California, but later on there will be productions in uh, in uh, uh, Texas, in Houston, Texas, but that's the end of next year. So the other place that Tesla cars are produced is in the Shanghai factory in China. Now, let's. I, I want to just mention a few things about the design. It's a very, I don't say weird looking, but here's one thing I can tell you. All of Tesla cars that are on the road, the Model S, the Model X, the Model 3, the Model Y, looked exactly or almost exactly the way they were first introduced uh, by Tesla, like let's say the prototype. So however they were introduced, that's how they almost looked like. Okay, except for the Model Y, the, I'm sorry, the Model uh, X, which had the old front fascia of the Model S, which then was upgraded to what it is now, and that's what the Model X uh, uh, got. So it is very unusual for any car manufacturer to produce a car that the same way it was introduced. The production and the introduction usually have nothing to do with each other, but not Tesla. It, you know, I must call it lame uh, what other car manufacturers now if you look at this design again uh, first of all I don't know if it's a two-door or a four-door it's hard to say uh, like I said the wheelbase in the back look very very strange all the way to the back there's no room between the rear wheels and the rest of the car it's like just something that doesn't happen so it's hard for me to imagine that the production car will be like this maybe it's just a sketch i believe this is just a sketch and i am sure that the that that the when whenever the this car will be introduced whatever name it will have uh guarantee that it's going to look the same or almost the same as it is going to be uh, sold and that is fantastic it really is fantastic so it's very very exciting it's very exciting to see that China is looking to staff their design center in China and hopefully sooner than later la later they are going to actually uh, start producing cars that uh, will fit the Chinese market which is of course different that's why the Model 3 is very successful it's a smaller car people in China like like that love this in all of Asia you know especially in Japan which is a small country in Europe so the big Tesla cars the X the, a, the X the S the S is a very big car not to mention that Cybertruck which Elon Musk said is going to be a, a smaller model for the for the uh, European uh, market but cars like this uh, smaller uh, Tesla brand of course the best in the world and in a uh, good price can really compete with a lot of uh, 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 models in, in Asia, especially in China, and later on in Europe. 
because unlike the United States, in Europe and in China, there are a lot of options for um, for uh, people to buy electric cars, not necessarily Teslas. Okay, so we'll see what happens, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a comment. Give me a like so people can see my videos. And I'll see you all tomorrow. It's Moshe the Electric Israeli. Thank you for watching. Really, really appreciate it. You can support this channel by, by subscribing. Give me a thumbs up, a like, so more people can see these videos. You can become a patron and support this channel. I need your support. You can buy merchandise, uh, swag, the Electric Israeli swag. Follow me on uh, social media. Use the links below to purchase things that are my favorite, that I that I buy myself. And that's the way you can help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.